I think it's still November, you hear me? They saying no, we saying yes, you hear me? <laughs> I'm really trying to take it there, but y'all gonna see my fourth quarter, we, you hear me? Fourth quarter, we just did shit, you hear me? Drop Giz, Glizzy, uh, uh, who else? What I just dropped? I just dropped uh, Fat Yee joint and Glizzy joint. Let's see what else I got. I got Sha Glizzy coming this Tuesday. What's that? The, the first or the last Tuesday of November, I got Glizzy dropping. The first Tuesday of December, I got Paco dropping. The Tuesday after that, I got Murder dropping. You hear me? We got fat shit on the way, and it's just the end of the fourth quarter. So that's what I'm saying. When we, when we really pop out fourth quarter or first quarter, it's first quarter right now, honestly, in my opinion. In my opinion, because we just, yeah, me and my boy World Films, we already done, yeah, me, we already loaded up and kitted up. By the time you see this, that shit already on the way. Right now, we on the road, about to go see, uh, we about to go see Paco today. Uh, a little quick studio session. We got to see Biggs and Dude a little bit later, too. We were supposed to see Flock today. We might see, but I don't know. You just got to stay tuned, you know what I'm saying? Like, we never really know what the day is like, so try and trying to put this little section together is it's a little tedious because we just be you know what i'm saying real going with the flow it be motion going on you just gotta get your surfboard and figure out where the waves at because it's always motion going on very moment it's history in the making you hear me these niggas about to get baked like a cake seriously all you all you in all you interview niggas all you i'm gonna ask you random question ass niggas all you oh yeah that's a good idea let me see what he talking about ass niggas all y'all niggas let me just show y'all to do it the right way because y'all really be looking nervous that's swag Niggas gotta fuck with you. Yeah. You gotta be able to be heard. Kill. You know what I'm saying? Like you drop your music, that shit getting heard. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I try to do some shit like that with some niggas. Like just go fifty fifty and not not pay for the beat. But I started doing like beat beat like packages. Like you know what I mean? Uh -huh. I ain't gonna tap like nigga get like he come to my studio or like come record with me. He ended up like probably give it like a month or two. He probably record on like ten of my beats. I yeah. probably throw ten of my beats to him as long as he give me on the credits for like probably like. Some cheap shit, bro. Yeah, some cheap yeah, shit. Yeah. But like, I just be, I just be making sure that I try to get some money on the spot because these niggas don't be doing streams, bro. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. honestly, either they are doing streams, but the stream don't even, they don't pay enough, bro. Mm -hmm. How was that joint last night? We pulled up right there, bro. Mm -hmm. No, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna text you when, uh, when I got up there and shit. That shit was cool though. We pulled up right there. Uh, mm -hmm. That shit was cool. One by the park, they tried to have us talking in the alley. I said, well, yeah, I can't risk it for the biscuit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, well, I don't blame you. I don't blame I can't you. Okay, really, we oh. got there. No, that's it. See, we parked in the man. parking lot. You know, they got like like little lots and shit. We look. I'll be we right had, We had too. to pay 20. Okay, okay. Why I do that? Huh? Man, they bust my jump last time, so I ain't even want to go. Bro, yeah. The first time we came in this motherfucker, bro, the first beat they paid was fun. And then it was like word around town, I think. Mm -hmm. Fuck. That shit just. We made like three songs the first day I came in this gym. All them motherfuckers is like hits right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Some of them songs didn't get dropped yet, so we just gonna put them on the next project and shit. Okay. And some, I, we, shit, we took some joints off to take two though. Which one? Oh, oh, oh we, did, we did take like two, three songs off that joint. Only cause we, it wasn't even, I think that joint was like numbers for real. That's the good thing about working with one producer, you know what I'm saying? You know, it's not it's a sound down fast. It's sound, it's sound, man. Yeah. 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 What you know about that brick money? I'm talking big money. Get you hit, get you killed, get you killed. That low, I take my ass up with look, I get right back. I'm getting scared, cause you seen my ass in red form. Running to them cars like a track star. You saying, whoa, if I ain't got what you looking for, you holler at my folks. Get 30 grand short. I'm straight up ten dollars, sell a new port. I can't do nothing with it. I let the youngest get it. I'm on some big money shit. I don't like you know how you gotta tell you like a producer what to do. Like all right, I want yeah, this yeah. to sell. I don't tell him shit, bro. <laughs> like I don't have, I don't tell him nothing. Like he just be he know he know he know. Like we here with the shit. Like you know what I'm saying. Like that shit. Day one. Yeah, since day one for real. We been here with the shit. Like he just know. That's how y'all know y'all a good team though. Yeah, I ain't gotta tell him shit. Like. I don't gotta tell him, nah, take this out. You know what I'm saying? He already know. Then I ain't no hating ass producer, because if he 
send me a beat from another producer. I'm gonna record that shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm make the whole nah, song sound clean. And that's one thing about him because we, 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 we were just talking about this the other day. We were just talking about this. Gonna be on like if it's if it's 19 songs, he gonna have like 10 or 11 tracks on the junk. But he was like, bro, I don't even give a fuck if I got five tracks on the junk, bro. He said just to make the song the best song. Whoever send that shit, bro, we gonna do that shit, bro. He said that shit makes sense. Now because it's like we really gotta go. We trying to be the biggest thing popping. So. Yeah, so this shit for the team, so like he'd sacrifice his own shit just so the, the the tape or the album could be great, you know what I'm saying? But me, you know me, I'm gonna make sure he got like ten jumps on there. I don't give a fuck what he say. You know what I'm saying? And this and this bitch uh Opago and Coke and the man putting this documentary together trying, you know, get, get the right shit so y'all can really, you know what I'm saying, make sure you got every piece of popcorn, you know, you get some popcorn and some of the kernels don't be pop, we trying to make sure all them bitches pop for y'all, yeah, butter than all, yeah, me really trying to get y'all right, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, hit every spat, make sure everything is covered, my man in the pack, we in the spat, real, I get ass shit, you know, come on up, got world films behind the camera, you hear me? I be getting some hard with that brick money. I'm talking big money. Did you kill? Did you kill? I don't break that shit, bro. I was telling I don't fuck with Detroit music like that, but the way that you do it, man. That ain't really Detroit music. That's not Detroit shit. This is some real South Korean shit, bro. So I take my ass up, but look, I get right back. Should've getting scared, should've seen my ass already. Running to them cops. You holla at my folks. Get 30 grand short. All straight up ten dollars. Sell a new port. I can't do nothing with it. I let the youngest get it. I'm on some big money shit. Nigga, my time is long. I'm waiting for flipping on them dirty matches, nigga. You know, you know, you know, you know, you be knowing the music, but you don't know where you know the music from. Like, you know, but you. That's influenced by Paco or inspired by Paco, man. Go crank on some beats, man. Or, or turn your shit up or, or get creative or stay motivated or. Well, go get you a fucking bag and get in the studio. No, seriously, or that one. That's that's your best option. That's your best bet. You can't be in the studio if you broke, bro. I'm trying to tell you, bro. The studio's not for broke niggas. No, yeah, Telling as they need to spin S P E N D. Yeah, and that's spin. S P I N. Spin. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shirt or something. Nigga, try to use that old goofy ass game to get free shit all day. That shit don't work like that. Seriously, you know, I ain't no rapper. That was Christmas Eve. Yeah. <laughs> oh my. Like, nigga, fuck you won't do that. My plug like, why the fuck would you do that? I feel like I want to pick up a new head. My niggas like, how the fuck you won't do that? My plug like, why the fuck would you do that? I feel like my life the newest movie. You probably watch this shit on Tubi. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, you could probably watch this shit on Tubi, on YouTube, on Tubi, on Netflix, and get said, checks. That nigga said, he said, I think I need to pick up a new hat. My homie's like, why the fuck would you do <laughs> Why the fuck would you do this? Really, really the dog, Bob, you hear me? Like my life, the newest movie. You could probably watch this shit on Tubi, or Netflix. I'm waiting on Netflix. Like, why the fuck would you do that? Feel like my life, the newest movie. You probably watch this shit on Tubi or Netflix. I'm in the studio with this nigga. Like, this is our first day in here. But listening to the music and being here, listening to the music, you were quiet. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. Listen to the music. You can't really imagine what this is like. Like, this nigga just laying down bar after bar. We just been dying laughing, like, in real time. Like, oh, bro, just say what? I always knew I had to give a game. Like, <laughs> what? Why he rapping? What? What?